annual Penny Stock Conference in Hollywood, Florida at the Diplomat Hotel. And with me, we have an inventor of, well, I'm going to let him tell you about it in just a second, but we may have to uh, flash you back to the old days of science class in elementary school to be able to tell you how a modern technological whiz has done his thing. Bob Teal is our inventor. We're, as we said, in Hollywood, Florida to... Bob, that's what you got here. Well, it's a... Uh... That uh, operates on uh, pulses of the uh, DC current from a, a battery bank. Uh, it uh, works on the principle of uh, electromagnetics, mm -hmm. and uh, uh, it uh, is uh, flexible in, uh, to the extent that uh, you can operate from 36 volts this particular engine, 24 volts or 12 volts. Okay. You can operate on uh, four cylinders if you want to call them that, or coils. Uh, or three or two or one, it operates pretty well in the hall. Uh, it depends on the amount of power that you want out, the mechanical power from the shaft, that is. And uh, uh, how it works, I suppose, uh, I should uh, talk about. Uh, it works on the principle that uh, a DC current is applied from the battery bank. This DC current is chopped into pulses. Uh, one pulse is applied to one coil. As that coil uh, does its job, when it reaches peak pull, it is then released and the, the next coil sequentially picks up the next pulse. Would you like to show us uh, point by point as we go through? And this is called an electromagnetic machine. Yeah. Magnetic, yes. All right. Uh, uh, show us exactly step by step as if we were in a science museum somewhere because I'm a novice at this. Uh, to demonstrate how the pull works, mm -hmm. Uh, I can use a little demonstration here. All right. Uh, this being a substitute for one of the coils here. All right. And uh, we'll turn it on, and it will pulse just as the engine does. Oh. And uh, uh, we are utilizing from each coil something that has never, to my knowledge, been utilized before. Uh, when a coil is energized, uh, a large magnetic field is built up. And uh, in the past, this magnetic field, when it collapses, it's called counter EMF or CEMF, is detrimental because it is then bucking the, the applied field. Uh, so if you can utilize the, uh, the collapsing field, which is in an opposite direction, uh, opposite polarity, uh, to my knowledge, it hasn't been done before. And, uh, you're making it easier then for the engine to perform, for the coil to perform, and you're pumping up voltages that are unbelievable. For example, we're using 12 volts here, mm -hmm. and we're up almost to 40 volts already. Now, that's usable voltage. That is, in essence, recycling electrical energy. You're recycling and In essence, that's exactly well you can see. Uh, we start out with 12 volts here, or right. two. Right. We're pulsing, we're, we're going into a coil, mm -hmm. an LC combination. The collapsing field is stronger than the applied field. Mm -hmm. So consequently, with a 12 volt supply, we're up to 40 volts, which is usable. Here's a 115 volt bulb that we're we'll put on, and uh, it, uh, can we do a weak night light? Yes, there it is. But, uh, you can, you're utilizing the, uh, the collapsing field that up until this point has never been used and it has been detrimental. Okay. As of now, uh, this, uh, <coughs> that's just to demonstrate what one coil does. Now each of the four coils, uh, you can uh, uh, collect the, the unused or detrimental uh, voltage or energy from. Right. The reason I, uh, I don't go into voltages, current, and so forth is it's energy. And one thing is it might be uh, um, basically uh, AC, mm -hmm. and another is pure DC, and it's chopped DC. It's the only thing is we just call it energy. All right, get yourself comfortable over well, here, and, and let's explain the rest of this machine. Well, we'll, 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 we'll turn the engine on. All right. Full speed, or for this part, I like to press that. And uh, it's a little noisy simply because uh, of vibration uh, that... Uh, could be taken out very easily, but uh, we'll turn it on uh, just for a minute. It's raw, except for the uh, beginning, when it's 
almost a third, as well as almost no need of a third. And that's simply because we have removed the unwanted calorie amount. But we not only remove it, but we utilize it. Our 30 pounds are now operating on three cylinders. Three cylinders. Now we're operating on two. Thank you. 